Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you what I got for my Ireland study abroad trip. I really hope that I'm in frame right now because I'm like, I've never really shot with this camera before for recording. So yeah, if you notice a difference in quality, it's because I got a new camera. It's the Canon ELPH 350HS, I think that's what it's called. And uh, basically, um, it's just a camera for me to, you know, vlog record my study abroad experience and all that good stuff. So today let's get to the point and I'm going to show you what all I got for my trip. The first thing I got were these boots. They're rain boots. Um, these are Kamix, K-A-M-I-K-S, and I got them, or sorry, K-A-M-I-K, not S, there's no S on that. But um, they're from DSW and I needed some rain boots because, first of all, I just needed rain boots in general, but really for the trip because it's supposed to rain a lot there. Um, I heard that people in Ireland don't really wear rain boots, but unless it's like really pouring, but I mean, so, I don't know. I just, I mean, like the gym shoes that I have, they have little air pores in them. So like, if it does rain, it'll get in my shoes and I don't want that to happen. So, I mean, these work fine too. The next thing I got was this coat. Um, it's waterproof, weatherproof, all that good stuff. And it's not like really insulated with fleece in the lining, but I mean, it's still pretty warm. Um, I also have a little fleece jacket to wear just in case it's not that cold or rainy. So I think this works really fine. And I got this from Burlington. Next thing I got, um, all the rest of this stuff, well, no, no, I take it back. Um, most of the stuff I got from Walmart. So this is one of my Walmart purchases. It is a weekender travel bag. Um, I honestly needed this for the longest, but I just never got it. I didn't know exactly where to purchase it other than Forever 21. But then I saw this at Walmart for $18.88 and I was like, yes. So I'll be using this as my carry-on bag for the flight. And I really like it because it's big. It's not too big, but it's pretty big. It's spacious. It has pockets in it. As a zipper right here and then it has two other pockets right here and it's green in it <laughs> and olive green is like my babe but green is my favorite color in general so yeah and I also love the fact that the straps were really sturdy and then it also comes with a third strap just in case you want to you know put it on your shoulder instead of like carrying it like this my next purchase were these pads I got 60 of them to last me my entire trip hopefully they do because if they don't I'm gonna be really upset and then I got the overnight ones. I got how many of these? I only got 27 of these because I don't use them every night that I'm on my period. But I mean, the nights that I do, you know, it's nice to have. So, and also, if like you do have a heavy flow, I would definitely suggest getting these because I wear these overnight so that you know they don't stay in my underwear. And I know that it may be gross for some of you out there that don't really want to talk about periods. But I mean, it's a real thing. So, and I think that this is really important. For women who do have heavy flows or just have medium flow and don't want their panties to stain while they're sleeping so works for me i hope it works for you too the next thing i got was this bottle love lotion it's the nivea yeah there we go it's the nivea essentially enriched body lotion it's for dry to very dry skin and i've been using this for the past couple of months and honestly um when i used to use certain types of lotion my skin would not stay moisturized throughout the day I suffer from dry skin as soon as I like take my jeans off or my jacket off or whatever and it would really suck but this has worked really well for my skin and I don't know if they have Nivea products in Ireland um, I'm a little bit ignorant to some of the products that they do have but they do have American brands but I mean I just wanted to have this just in case and it lasts me for a really long time so I think it'll be fine for the time that I'm in Ireland the next important product is this medicine. I definitely needed the daytime and nighttime or day quill and night quill medicines. I really wanted the capsules but I didn't think about it. I just grabbed what I saw and there we go. So I mean it doesn't really matter. The only difference would be like how heavy it would make my bag but I mean it's okay. So I do get colds. Um, I don't exercise as much as I should which is probably why my immune system kicks my butt when I do get sick so I definitely needed some of this and I didn't know if they had this in Ireland like the day pool and night pool. like of course they have cold medicines of course they have you know drugstores and all that stuff but I don't know how different the product varies from like country to country so just in case just in case 
Next, I got some Crest toothpaste. It is the baking soda and peroxide whitening toothpaste. Um, I just wanted to bring a tube with me because obviously, like, I won't want to spend time shopping as soon as I get to Ireland. I mean, I'm pretty sure that I'll be super exhausted from the flight and it's just going to be a whole bunch of orientation and meet and greets and all that other stuff. So I wouldn't know when I would have time to go get the essentials. Okay. And then I also got this, um, it's like a generic brand of Pepto-Bismol chewing tablets. Um, it's to just, you know, settle your stomach and prevent diarrhea and all that stuff, heartburn, all that other stuff. So I wanted this because I do get um, stomach cramps sometimes and you know it might be from a certain spicy food that I eat or something else and I just really wanted to get these as a just in case. I also got this Cantu Shea Butter um, Hydrating Cream Conditioner as well as this Leave-In Conditioning Cream. Um, I don't know if they have natural hair products in Ireland, I'm sure they do, but I mean I don't want to risk it and then be out there but out. So I was going to say ass out, but I don't, I don't want my family to know that I curse on my channel. I just cursed. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's essentially what I got. And I've never tried the conditioner before, but it's sulfate free. So I feel like it's good for my hair. Also, I really enjoy the creamy products. And then I got this deodorant. Um, where did I get this? I got this from Walmart too. It actually came in a pack of two for like four... 30 or something 365 or something it was really cheap um getting two for the price of one at other stores that's pretty decent so got the powder one because all the other ones irritate my skin i don't know why i also got this dove sensitive skin soap um i wanted to i was a little bit on the fence about whether i should get body wash here or there but then i realized that like you know as soon as i get there what if i want to shower or you know what if I want to wash my face? Like, I wouldn't have any product to, you know, get me through at least one day. So, I figured that I might as well get three bars instead of just one. So, I got this from Family Dollar, by the way. They have a lot of the brand name stuff for cheaper costs. So, anything that's cheaper, especially when it comes to my money, I'm definitely on board for that. And then I got my number seven. It is the cleansing balm for dry and very dry skin. If you saw my last video on products for dry and sensitive skin, then you know that this is like my go-to for washing my face and moisturizing my face. All I do is wet my hands, put the product in my hand, you know, spread it around and then wash it off and then dry it off with a dry towel and then I'm good for the day. So if you want to know, I got this from Target. Um, I looked for it in Walmart, couldn't find it. I think that Target is the only place that sells number seven products, but correct me if I'm wrong. You know, if you know any other place that sells the products, let me know and I'll check it out. And last but not least, a memory card. Um, my camera came in and I realized that I needed a memory card. For some reason, I thought that it came with the camera because the camera was not cheap. So I was like, oh, sure, it comes with it. No, it, it didn't. So what I did was I went to Walgreens and I got the SanDisk Ultra Plus SDHC UHS I card. It is 16 gigabytes and it uploads 48 millibytes per second. Or is it megabytes? I think it's megabytes per second. So I got this and um, I think the original price was like $29.99 or it was like $19.99 or something. I think it might have been $19.99. But um, I ended up getting two of these because they each cost... $9.99 each and I was like I might as well get two for the price of one so yeah so that was a really good deal at Walgreens and um I forget that I might as well get two because I don't know exactly how many pictures or how many videos that I'll be taking and it's better just to get what you need now than wait later so yeah I think that's all the products and things that I got that I needed for Ireland I didn't get any new clothes I didn't get any new shoes other than the boots um, because I don't want to overpack and if I do need other stuff to wear, I can just get it there. I'm pretty sure their clothes are cheaper than they are here. And yeah, so that's about it. So thank you so much for joining me in this video. Stay tuned because I'll be uploading my vlog about my trip to Ireland soon, hopefully by next week. So yeah, talk to you next time. Bye-bye.